How's it going, everyone? This is the old Game Vlog here playing Counter Strike Source. On this uh, somewhat short video, I want to talk about the end of 2013, uh, the discussion or a small talk of the, the end of 2013 uh, or 2013 uh, in gaming. Alright, so this is gonna be a very, very short version um, of some of the gaming events and things that happened throughout this year. We've had a lot of good good things happening and some bad things happening as well. But I like to think I'm a, I'm a positive type of guy and I do like to think that the uh, good things outweigh the bad things that happen. And I would like to see the, you know, the bright side. Anywho, um, I'm going to be first and foremost talking about the games that came out this year. Now I know the list is massive and I could be talking about these games for hours in here. But I'm I'm not going to. I'm just going to be uh, quick and, and straight to the point in the sense that I will uh, have, I would battle myself for, for a few hours on this, uh, on how I would I would discuss these games. And in our, I wanted to originally include a top 10 list, a top 5 list, pardon. But then I couldn't find, uh, I couldn't fit all the games that I wanted just in 5, so I, then I had to make a top 7, then from 7 it would be a top 10, then top 15, top 25. I just decided to, you know what, the four top games that come to my head right now is the, f the top games, the, the four games that I will just mention in this video and all the other ones I'll just make a list in the comment section uh, in honorable mentions. The first game that, that set a massive impression on me, the, the one of the first that came out this year was um, The Last of Us. If you guys don't know what The Last of Us is, whew, you've been missing out, but uh, any gamer or, or any person should know what, it, what The Last of Us is. And The Last of Us is to me, or it caused the same impression to me, but even better, uh, the same thing that the uh, another PlayStation ex uh, 3 exclusive from the same company uh, as well. No, wait, it wasn't from the same company. Uh, the, the ones that made it was Quantic Dream, so it wasn't the same company, but it was kind of close to it, uh, would be Heavy Rain. Uh, I have played Heavy Rain on my channel, full gameplay as well, with all the decisions I've made. And... The Last of Us brought the Heavy Rain in me. The same impression that Heavy Rain had, the same strong story, but better. I gotta say, The Last of Us was, to me, better than Heavy Rain. It was one of them games that I, I just could not wait to get my hands on. And I loved every single second of it. I think it was one of the, the best games of this year. Not in, in terms of the, the gameplay, but the story on the game is just phenomenal. Uh, perhaps one of the best stories in the history of gaming. Who knows? Um, the second game on my list of these four games that I'm going to mention would be GTA V, of course. Uh, GTA V, I think it, it it broke almost every single record in the history of gaming as well. It sold more copies in, in 24 hours than many games sold in their entire lifetime combined. So uh, it sold, at the moment, 26 million copies. And I say at the moment because I don't know uh, the full figures yet. And this was only on the PS3 and Xbox 360. If it had, to, if the game was also available for the PC and the next-gen consoles, I think 26 million would, would be only a quarter of it. I think it would, might, it would easily beat the 15 million sales. I believe in that. I believe that it could have gotten a lot more than it did. Would it have been coming out on multiple uh, platforms? But I can understand why they didn't. I mean, they spent 150 million making this game, and it, you, you know it, they spent a lot of money and time, and they only have a, a certain size team. So obviously, they couldn't get everyone. Uh, they couldn't do too much. Which I'd rather them do only on two consoles, but great than on ten consoles and being meh. It's all right, I suppose. Like uh, Battlefield 4 and Call of Duty Ghost did. They tried to do too much too soon. Didn't come out very well, did it? Anyways. Um, Daisy Standalone has been out, actually, for a couple of days at least. Uh, since this recording, which is to this 19th. I think it came out a couple of days, yeah. I wanted to make a, a video on the Daisy, but I've been so busy that I've, I just haven't had the time or the energy to do any videos. So, s sorry about that, guys. I will promise that I will make Daisy videos standalone version uh, sometime soon but um, yeah Daisy standalone came out which is was exactly what I was waiting for um, I, I, I've been telling you guys this I have not to this day played the Daisy game mod 
because I've been waiting for the standalone. Unfortunately, it's out now. I don't have it yet, but I will do sometime soon. Which will uh, move on, move me on to the next game on my list, which is Rust. I've been wanting to play that game since I first seen video game play footage of it, since I first heard of it. It's been one of them games that I just... I want it. And, and, and it might seem like, like I'm just a kid shouting, I want it, I want it, I want it, but it is. Um, it was actually the first time ever that I've actually contacted the, the game maker and, and the guy that makes the game, uh, Gary Newman. The very first time I contacted him to ask him for, for the keys. But by the time I did that, it was a bit too late because the game just came out on Steam as well. So, yeah, I mean, it was the first and only time that I've done that. And we lost this round, sadly. I'm not a very good counter-terrorist. Uh, I'm not even very good at this game. I, I never have been. Uh, oh, well. Um, yeah, I mean... Back to the topic, uh, Rust. Rust is, you guys are going to see game footage of Rust pretty soon, I promise you. That's still in this year. I have Rust footage coming up pretty soon. Rust gameplay is going to be, is going to be flooding my channel. Um, I'll guarantee you that. It, it, it is. It will have a lot on my channel. Um, yeah, that, that's my, my top, uh, my top four games out of the top of my head. I'm not going to do too much and I'm not going to do, uh, you know, too little. Uh, obviously, 2013 is also the year that PS4 and Xbox One came out, and also the Oya, uh, which is another console which a lot of people seem to forget. It's not that great of a console. I don't particularly like it. Uh, I obviously prefer the PS4 better than the Xbox One with all its controversy. Um, but yeah, I just thought I want to talk about games for a little bit with you guys. I haven't done these type of videos in ages, and I just wanted to, you know what? Put my heads out there, put some thoughts out there of, of the games that I want. Uh, I might do a more detailed version of top games sometime soon. I do have 40 minutes of video footage of this game. Look at this, this is like a pussy match. It's just missing everything. This is like the bots playing, by the way. So they're just shooting at each other and then missing. And finally one kills the other and we win that tank. I don't even know. Anyways, um... Yeah, I, I've been one. I got 40 minutes of gameplay footage. I might just get around some friends and we might just talk for 40 minutes about video games. Of course, what else could we talk about? Because um, yeah, that that's why I got a YouTube channel. Uh, that's why I started all this thing to to you know talk game, play some video games, talk about video games, share my passion, share my my hobby and in my interest and and what I like about the, the games with everyone. I don't have a good you know big audience yet or you know but I do have a, a, an audience out there I, I do believe so um, and I just want to you know say thank you thank you to everyone who, who's been watching my videos supporting me in every way and thank you for everyone who's, who's been there for me I'm at uh, 711 subscribers at the time of this recording which is more than I ever thought I was ever gonna get I honestly never thought I was going to get past 60 su subscribers, but I did, you know, uh, I did. Which is, uh, again, it doesn't, I'm not hang up on numbers, number of subscribers, number of video views or whatever. I'm just, I just want to meet new people that like video games and, and, you know, make some friends and stuff like that. Um, but yeah, uh, before I go, I just want to say I have a have very happy Christmas to everyone. And I uh, hope you guys stay well and warm with your families. And uh Get a lot of Christmas presents. It's been the All Game Vlog. Thank you for watching, guys. Peace. Thank you for watching my video. If you liked it, you can hit that like button. Follow me on Twitter and Facebook for all my video updates. Oh, and subscribe on YouTube. Want to see more of this series? Check out the playlists on the left side or the previous or the next video of this series.